Following the recent call for restructuring by state governors across APC and PDP, particularly on state policing, some analysts have accused these state executives of selfishness. This is against the backdrop of commendation by some pro-restructuring advocates who are excited over this singleness of purpose. Jacinta Obuku has more. The APC governors with their PDP counterparts have faulted the present administration's approach of handling the security situation in the country and hammering on restructuring, which some like this analysts believe it's a good thing and timely. A general national discontentment with the way things are and is not um, sectional, not south, east, west. People are really fed up with this um, centralized governance style that we have. That's on one hand. Secondly, it's not even difficult to see why governors would want to support restructuring, because restructuring really brings more powers, more capacities, more resources, uh, more attention, more concentration to the federation unit, which is where they superintend over, uh, where they govern. So it's only natural, it's only expected that the governors would be um, joining the clamor for restructuring. The system has been practiced in Nigeria today has failed. This system, which is such that has given so much power to the central government, where states have to go and in cap every month end you know, to get money to run their state, has failed. And that is why I think the governors and those who are now joining the call for restructuring are only trying to play along, you know, what be, seems to be the popular opinion of well-meaning Nigerians today. These governors, whether they are sincere or not, restructuring is an idea whose time has come. Part of the governor's recommendation in the communique is the call for the federal government to take bold and deliberate steps to ease the tensions in the country and concentrate on projects and policies that would promote national unity and cohesion. However, the synergy demonstrated by these governors is viewed as having ulterior motive. Politicians generally are always united when it serves their better interest. So they are united, I can tell you that for a fact. They are all united for the simple reason, not because it's what is better for the system or for the society, because they don't really care about what is, uh, most of them don't really care about what is the best interest of the society. But anything that will give them more money, more power, more control, Trust me, they are always united. The hope is that there will be positive results to lower tensions in the country. The bigger picture, according to the keen observers, is a people's constitution rather than few constitutional amendments. Jacinta Obuku reporting for PLOS TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.